we all know that in UPSC examination prelims is just a qualifying paper our rank depends upon the marks in the mains so the candidate who writes mains answers very well will get a good rank and we have seen in the last few years that many candidates with the average knowledge also are getting good marks in UPSC mains exam because of their answer writing skills hence answer writing practice becomes very important because some students though they have very good knowledge they lack answer writing skills because of which they score less marks in the mains okay now we all know that we all should do answer writing practice but here the question in the minds of many is that shall we write the answer for a topic only after we have complete knowledge on the topic shall we write answer for certain uh, subject like history geography or polity of UPSC only after we finish the complete subject we finish the subject three to four times and only after we gain the complete knowledge no the answer is a clear no because I know many students who do not write the answers still I mean till they are perfect most of them do not even touch the mains answer writing for polity till they are perfect in the polity they will not even start history answer writing till they are perfect in history but that is a bad practice let me tell you you have to start answer writing practice right from the beginning I mean for example you have given a single reading of ancient history some five six chapters you have read a single reading in textbook three four questions are given from that uh, from those chapters shall we write answers yes you have to practice you may think that sir as I have read those five chapters only once how can I write an answer see whatever you remember in the first reading whatever points vaguely remember use those points and write the answer later on when you do second and third reading your answer may become better but as of now you just write the answer with the limited knowledge for example there are some topics which you have just heard in the class you just heard from the faculty shall you write answer yes even if you have just heard from the faculty or even if you have just written the uh, running notes for the topic even then you practice two or three questions on that of course you may think that uh, sir just by hearing the class I cannot get gain complete knowledge you know it's okay even if you have little knowledge try to present that little knowledge in your answer some students will be asking me sir for example agriculture is a topic about which I never read but I have some common knowledge Gen see we all know the problems agriculture in general right so you can write one or two questions on them also so answer writing practice means even if you have half knowledge or vague knowledge on that area still you can practice answer writing the reason is because friends the reason is that in UPSC mains also there will be some questions about which you would not have read means those questions are completely new to you every year in GS 1 2 3 4 of course different subject GS 1 2 3 you get some questions about which you have never read about which you have you would have heard somewhere or read somewhere single time or you have vague knowledge or half knowledge even then you should be able to write the answer in the mains but how can you get the confidence that you can write the answer for the questions which you are not very clear about that confidence you can get only if you start mains answer writing practice from the beginning you should have a habit of writing the answer with half knowledge or little knowledge on that area but don't worry as you prepare more and more slowly your answer will have better and better points now of course but see there will be some areas for example medieval history is there Delhi Sultanate some question has come but you have never heard never read did not anything in that case of course you should not write and you know to practice I am not talking about those things about which I have no idea about otherwise please do not wait till you finish the complete syllabus for mains answer writing practice it will be a big blunder if you do that many candidates who are doing that are not getting time for answer writing because let me tell you you can never finish any syllabus any subject of UPSC completely you can finish it only before day of the examination so don't wait for the time the answer writing practice shall be in tandem shall be parallel to your preparation it should go hand in hand in a harmonious way